YouTube channel. If you do not know me, my name is Keanu Curry, the one and only Keanu Curry. And in this video today, I'm going to tell y'all about... <sighs> I don't know if I want to tell how I found out I was pregnant or the story time behind me getting pregnant. I think I'm going to tell y'all how I found out I was pregnant. And then I'll tell, like, um, in the next video... Um, the story time of how I created my son, how we created my beautiful son, and I'll give y'all the dates too. Oh, um, yeah, I was talking about your father today. Oh, yeah. Um, I, um, so my child's father is not just anybody, okay? Let's just say that he's not just anybody. He also was one of those people that was constantly trying to talk to me when I was in my previous relationship. And I kind of used to like push him off to the side, y'all. He was trying for years, like <laughs> for years. And I would just always be like, no, 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 because I always been in a relationship. So finally, when I get single, um, it's crazy how life works. So when I became single that's when i got pregnant like after me and tape broke up that's when i got pregnant and i got pregnant at a time where i wasn't depressed depressed but i was kind of like getting over a breakup still like finding myself and all that and talking to my child's father at the same freaking time i was multitasking nobody knew i was talking to him other than my ex fiance, the other person, and my friends, but nobody else knew. Only reason why my ex fiance know is because I had to tell him. Now, granted, I didn't have to really, but I decided to tell him because, first of all, when you're getting out of a relationship and you're dealing with someone else and it hits the media, I know on my behalf you're going to feel embarrassed you're going to feel <laughs> all kind of ways so i thought it was just best that i would disclose that information with him even though he didn't do it for me and i'm saying it because i just didn't know nothing i didn't know nothing i was like blindsided just you know but i still did the right thing and that's why i'm always going to stay blessed but either let's just jump into this video right there um i got pregnant I got pregnant um really fast. <laughs> I got pregnant really fast. Okay. I stopped having sex with my last like with my ex fiance in I wanna say not even October of twenty twenty two because I was already gone from that relationship mentally. I was only still being around because I felt like he needed me. So, yeah. I stopped having sex with him and like, maybe September, October. Cause I don't remember no November, December. Cause he's somebody at my crib, so whatever. Whatever. Um, I stopped having sex with him. I just couldn't see myself being sexually attracted to none of that because the way how it's been treated but um i started having sex with other with someone else i think it was after my relationship <laughs> that's all i know um but yeah i got pregnant february 27th okay but it didn't the, the sex didn't end till like 28th of February. Yes. Anyway, so I didn't need pregnant. So I got pregnant February 27th, but I told my doctor two days because of like um I don't know if it's 12 o'clock and it's still going. I don't know if it was this, 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 but I think it was the 27th to be sure. Or whatever. 
so uh february 28th i was um i was on my cycle so i wasn't thinking i mean you know girls ladies and gents when you're on your cycle you do have like your hormones different like so um my child's father we was having a conversation or whatever but prior to all this i will call him Prior to all this, I would call him baby daddy. Or he'd call me baby mom. It was just, it was, my mom's not thinking none of it like it's really gonna happen. So, I thought that I was pregnant. Um, let's skip it up. I found out I was pregnant. Pregnant, I'm still pregnant. March 25th. I was four weeks, nothing like three days or something like that. Now I am currently six months and counting. <laughs> I'm almost at, we're almost at the finish line. I, the way how I found out I was ready was crazy, y'all, because I'm thinking my cycle was coming. I'm thinking nothing happened to me, girl, because imagine when I was in my last relationship, we was always having unprotected sex, and I, he was always nothing to me, but I just never got pregnant. I knew that was never gonna happen because of medical history. Not on my end, but on the other party end. So um, that's a different conversation, but it's not needed for this video. Uh, so I thought that I was never gonna be the mom until I got my child's father. My child's father is much better. So he is 100% healthy. Mm -hmm. He's not one of those people that drinks a lot, smokes a lot, and just overdo it he's one of those guys that's like clean healthy you know he's one of those it only took me 18 seconds <laughs> it only took 18 seconds to turn into 18 years so let me tell y'all i had a company the day that i found out i was pregnant i wasn't in a relationship so if i could talk to a billion niggas i could <laughs> So I had a company or uh, whatever, but I wasn't dealing with that person like for real, for real, I just had a company. Who doesn't like have a company? That's what I So um, I had a company or whatever. Mind you, prior to this, I was noticing different things about myself. Like I would eat like pizza and fucking sour cream with hot peppers. I would be mixing shit together. I'm thinking I'm over here trying new food out the whole time. Baby girl, you're having cravings. <laughs> I did not know any of this until it was confirmed that I was breaking. My friend Jesse was like, uh, Kiana, uh, I think you're pregnant. I'm like, no, I'm not. I, I can't be like, yeah, my baby did nothing to me. We had this conversation and y'all, what y'all find out that story? <laughs> Like, yeah, he's nothing to me, but I get nothing. I used to get nothing all the time, and I would never end up pregnant as I thought. So, uh, I was waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting on my period to come. Y'all also know, like, if you have sex like one to two, maybe three days after you come off your cycle, you're bound to get pregnant faster. Must you just all be that? So, um, yeah. So then, um, they already had eight minutes and some change. So, um, yeah, she like, Kiana, I think you're pregnant. I'm like, no, I'm not, no, I'm not. And mind you, y'all, this shit's so funny because the day before I found out I was pregnant, I posted on my Instagram. I was like, if my baby don't come out with this kind of hair, I'm gonna be mad. I gotta find that post, y'all. I have got to find that post. I has to, I think my baby did send it to me. It was like, what you mean? <laughs> I think it did to me. It was like, what you mean? Or something like that. So, uh, yeah, moving forward. So, she said, she said, I am. I said, I'm not. Said, I'm not. Mm -hmm. So, one day, uh, like I said, I was still getting my PMS, which is like cramps, eating, bloating, you know, gas and all that stuff. I'm still, I'm still experiencing normal. So, one day, it was the day I had company. I went to the bathroom. Everybody was asleep, but Jesse woke up. Jesse was woke. Um, I think I, she had to do it. She had to do it. 
So I go to the bathroom. Don't tell me just get up and go to the bathroom. I don't know in bed. I'm like, let me just go to the bathroom and just take a test to be sure. Because Je if Jesse said it, then it's real. So I went to the bathroom. Um, mid shift to be peeing, I stopped peeing. So then I'm like, let me just take this test. So I get up. I go under the sink in my bathroom. Because Jesse has applied the bathroom, like pregnancy test, stuff like that. For situations like this. So, um, I took the test and it came back so fucking fast. I was like, nah, <laughs> nah, 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 nah. <laughs> I was in such disbelief, like, nobody ever just, just can When I say I was flabbergasted, I was flabbergasted. Um, first person I told immediately was Jessie, because she's in the same household as me. And like, why not do that? So I tell Jessie, she said, yeah, bitch, I knew you was. So then I had to tell my child's father that I was pregnant. And then I had to tell my company I was pregnant. Then I told my sister I was pregnant. Then I told my siblings that I was pregnant. And then, like, weeks later, days later, I told my dad I was pregnant. So, I kept it off the media until my birthday, which was May 16th. But I was throwing a little shade, like, a little jazz here and there. But it's like, I'm pretty sure they're like, yeah, that was great. Because why she said it? <laughs> so... I finally came out about my pregnancy May 16th on the day of my 23rd birthday. My symptoms was the same as PMS, y'all. That's why I'm just like, ain't no way it is the same. You know, because when I was trying to get pregnant in my last relationship, I, y'all, I studied how to get pregnant because I, because I, the situation we was in, I had to get pregnant instantly. It was no way. <laughs> but, um, I thought I was, I'm just like, okay, I don't want to have kids. If I had kids, I had kids. If I don't, I don't. I'm not in a rush. Woo -woo. And mysteriously, magically, I get pregnant. Week, months later, after this person breaks up with me, that ain't nothing but going. I was going to be pregnant by the wrong person, and God had found me the right person to get pregnant by. That's how I look at it. That's how we look at it. But, um, I am so happy to be a mom. I am so happy to for it to like the new chapter, the new beginnings, the new everything. I don't have to spend holidays alone anymore. I don't have to worry about the nigga cheating on me. No, 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 no. My maple turn is looking at my son, and that's 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 all. And I wanted a girl, but well, my doctor said you're having enough. Like he's healthy, he's male. I'm like, so funny how life works because I was just damaged by a male. And God gave me a mail, <laughs> which is my son. But like, uh, yeah, that's kind of pretty much it. All my symptoms. All my symptoms was the same as the PMS. Okay, basically, y'all. But my child's father. That's all y'all need to know. Everybody wants to know, like, who my child father is and all that. Just know he is a nigga that's tall with wigs, hella tattoos. He has a kid. Um, <laughs> now he got you. Uh, he's Muslim. He's very intriguing. Uh, never underestimate him. He's not like these other guys, though, for sure. Um, that's pretty much it, though. How I found out I was pregnant, but I'm gonna tell y'all next time, story time about the process of creating my son. Um, knew that was gonna happen because we've already discussed it, just, we've already confirmed it through text messages <laughs> that that's what was going to happen. But it ended up happening like for real, for real, and that motherfuckers was like. I was just joking, <laughs> but it is what it is. We both. You know, but 
I'm just happy to be a mom. Even though sometimes it can get a bit like exhausting because my son has a party every night and he likes to eat. He likes to, he likes when I sing and play music. He likes, he likes a lot of stuff. He's so funny too. Especially when we go to like that one skeleton in our um, Archer's house. That man is so funny. Like the last one we just went to, my um, my doctor was trying to get his face for the ultrasound. <laughs> and my son was like this the whole time. <laughs> he was like this the whole time. So she made me get up and go pee to like, you know, so she can get a clearer shot of his heart or whatever. So then I thought I peed and I came back and, you know, she searched me or whatever. He decides to turn to the side. <laughs> He turned to the side with his hands, like he was playing with his feet. I was just like, this son is, this is definitely my son. <laughs> this is definitely mine. <laughs> but y'all, anyway, that is enough for this YouTube video. This is the time that I'm going to start like posting about my pregnancy. I just really want to keep it all to myself. But it's like, my supporters deserve to know where I've been. But, um... I caught up for today. I'm not. I'm still not feeling well. Like you hear me out of breath. Like I'm just trying to keep myself hydrated together, trying to keep it moving and flowing. I just have to go home. I was having an anxiety attack, a mental breakdown. Like I was going through today at work, and I just felt like you know what? I need to go home. I need to go home today. But y'all, that is enough for this video. I'll see y'all in the next freaking video. Bye.